to another episode of the SAK Show brought to you by Mac Coffee. Power your now. Thank you, Royal Orchid and, of course, Bollywood Casino and the Wet Lounge. Today, it's all about our teeth. You know, they say our danda, our menno. Let's find out more from a specialist called Lisa. It's the in thing right now, and that's why she is here. Lisa, welcome on board. <laughs> Thank so you. Nice Shani. to have you. Thank you for your time. Thank you. I mean, I can see you've come with your gadgets and everything. Yes, yeah? yes, uh, indeed. It <laughs> is. Uh, it's mobile. The yeah. shop moves. It can yeah. come to you. That's or so you cool, can come man. To the shop. That's so cool, man. <laughs> now, before we get into that, Lisa, what, what, what? It's all about Amazing Smile Kenya, right? Yes, it is. Before we get into Amazing Smile, tell us about yourself. Tell us a bit about your background. Oh, my background yeah. was uh, full-time employment okay. for 15 years. Wow. Yeah, it was. And uh, um, after that, I decided to prioritize. You said enough is enough. I prioritized family, mm -hmm. oh, okay. which is the root as yeah. millennials are, you know, true, true. up with that. Yeah. <laughs> so in doing that, I had to find something to do. Mm -hmm. And this was actually introduced to me in a sales pitch. Oh, really? So Here after, or outside? Here, uh -huh. here locally, okay. obviously. Okay. And someone was pitching me to come and do it. Okay. So when they did that, yeah. I thought, well, this makes a little bit of sense. Okay, okay. So that's why amazing smile. I can see your teeth. Are, you know, I'm just checking them yeah, out. Yeah, of course. They're, I they're, they're pretty shiny, you know, like oh, Absolutely. <laughs> every time, every day. <laughs> so what exactly is amazing smile, Kenya? Amazing smile, Kenya, is cosmetic teeth whitening. Okay. It is non-invasive. Mm -hmm. It is just shy of dentistry because it's not invasive. It's okay. completely about vanity. Okay. About the shade of your teeth uh -huh. and how white they can get and how white they can look. So what exactly is this teeth whitening? Teeth whitening, basically we use uh, we chemicals uh -huh. to change the color of your teeth from the inside out. Just to make them whiter. Whiter? Yeah, whiter. Okay. So the usual, it can be anything. It can be your tea, coffee stains, yeah. your red wine stains, yeah. your cigarette stains, uh, food stains, age. You know, with age, your teeth, your milk tea. Mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. when you were 16 and hot, it's no longer looking as hot as it was <laughs> at 16. So you have to, you want to bring that back yeah, up, yeah. lift your face and your smile a little bit. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, and then you can't get this with regular toothpaste and all that. You can in like yeah. three years in of... Of brushing your teeth about you know, 10 times well, a day. I've brushed Probably for 36 could. years, but I haven't got it yet. <laughs> so this is obviously new, new yeah. technology and what. Everything is yeah. always moving forward. Yeah. And now there's teeth whitening, okay. which you can bring to your home or uh -huh. your office. Before we go into the whitening also, now, maybe you can share with our viewers, what exactly ca causes the, the discoloration or... Generally, I believe all teeth come white and then they end up becoming black, blue, whatever color, but brown. What causes that? Uh, it can be caused by several things. Most of the time, it's habits, our normal habits. Yeah. Your tea, coffee in the morning, then you don't rinse, like, you know, we don't bother to take such good care of our teeth. Yeah. Irregular visits to the dentist. Yeah. So you don't get people who do their annuals like mm -hmm, they're supposed mm -hmm, to. Mm -hmm. um, food, food staining. Yeah. Over time, over yeah. time, over time, the little, little deposits of the food yeah. will go and settle in the very tiny pores of your enemy. Okay. Yeah. And it's and it's um, it's harmful when all these things happen. To it's your teeth. Uh, certainly harmful long term. That's when you get your tooth decay, your dental yeah. caries, mm -hmm. and especially if you don't brush too often, they start rotting. Your gums are not so good. Okay. The appearance, of course, deteriorates okay. much faster than anything. Uh -huh. Your gum health is unwell, and it's just an unpleasant situation in your wow. mouth. Okay. Yeah. Wow. So that's when your product comes in. This is where the product comes in. The product is, of course, an add-on, a cosmetic add-on to mm -hmm. your annual maintenance, mm -hmm. your regular maintenance. This does not mean do not maintain your yeah, teeth. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah, a lot yeah. of people think it's a shortcut. It's like you can you just have this, and then you don't need to brush exactly, for one year. I don't need to brush my teeth. I just yeah, go and get them yeah, whitened yeah, and do yeah, all of this yeah. and all of that. No, you no, can't. It doesn't. You okay. still have to do your annual to the dentist. Yeah. But the scaling and polish removes kind of like the settled stuff on your teeth. Mm -hmm. This will change the color and bring it back to a more youthful white. Okay, so does it give yeah. you your, you know, I'm just curious, you know, you might be saying this guy's questions are too lame, but it's like, <laughs> it's lame and questions. Does it, A, do you have to do it annually? You don't have to do it annually. If yeah. you're good, you can go up to four years without whitening again. Okay. Yes. And, and does it whiten your teeth or does it give you a general original color of your teeth? 
Um, I wouldn't say original color of your teeth because, yeah. for example, people with mild, shall we say, fluorosis, you mm -hmm. know, the staining of your teeth because yeah. of water you ingested uh, while you were small. Yeah. If that stain goes, we can't say it's back to the original mm -hmm. color of your tooth. Mm -hmm. So it will definitely be a bit whiter okay. than your natural God-given color. Okay. And, and when do you realize that you actually need to do this? Or who has to do it? Everybody can do it. Absolutely everybody can do There's it. There's no uh, like a requirement or you see... There's no requirement <laughs> other than, of course, yeah. we... When you come and do a cosmetic whitening treatment, your dentals and your oral situation has to be like no above, you know, normal or yeah. good. Okay. You can't have an ongoing situation yeah. and then whiten your teeth. Okay. No. We come from the presumption that you are of good oral health and you've yeah. been doing your annuals and... Okay. Everything is so if somebody has never gone to a dentist, maybe just twice uh, in his life to remove teeth or something, cannot do this? They can do it, but they wouldn't get as good results Okay. Wow. as somebody who visits the dentist. And when you do come to our offices or I come to you and yeah. there's a situation happening, yeah. you first, I will recommend the dentist. So how does it work? Let's say I want to do it now. So I tell you, okay, Lisa, I want to do it. What's the next step? The next step is, first of all, we have a look, yeah. find out your dental history, your last okay. visit to the dentist, okay. how that went and all of that. And then we begin with our magic. Okay. Yeah. So maybe, you know, now I think you, you can just explain to our viewers what your mobile shop is all about. Okay, so this is um, an example of what we would bring if you were coming to do vitamin at your home or at your preferred venue or the spa. So we have different sets of... Uh, whitening we have different levels and different concentrations of the chemicals so we have our scale here if you can see it yeah this is our r20 guide it's the guide that shows you know probably where you were and where we're trying to end up we have our goggles to protect you from the light and this for example is our 20 minute product which is non-peroxide and then we have our peroxide products, which are in kits like this, but we can't open them and see them just here. And these have several, you know, concentrations of peroxide, different concentrations of peroxide, which mean higher levels of whitening or more intense whitening. Yeah. And this is the light. This is an LED light that catalyzes the reaction within your mouth that makes the whitening happen a bit faster. And if you without it, well, it would take a bit longer to do the whitening. Some people say they don't need it. Our manufacturer says it's an imperative that we use it. Super. But not the little, not the little one. It has to be this fellow. Okay. Yeah. Awesome, awesome stuff. And pretty interesting stuff. You know, the, I just love the fact that you're getting cool goggles with it. Yeah, you have <laughs> and, cool goggles and, 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 and you you can come to my house or to my office and to do the whole. Uh, process and everything yeah you know uh, the thing is that now it's like some people say you know when you do we uh, teeth uh, whitening and all your teeth tend to become weak and all that well, what's your take on that my take on that is this is over whitening okay. or using the wrong kind of chemicals mm -hmm. if you go and use something that is very strong for example you'll find this um people who are just using something that they they put direct acid on your teeth yeah Definitely, that's going to have an effect on okay. the state of your enamel. But if you use the right products yeah. and if you're using the right thing, the right protocols or following the correct methods and yeah. everything is kind of monitored, yeah. which is why we don't do, we prefer not to give people kits uh, and to come okay. and do it ourselves. So we can monitor uh, yeah. and see that we're doing this and, you know, you're doing the right thing mm -hmm, and all mm -hmm. of that. That will mitigate any kind of someone overusing, overusing the product, it, overexposing uh, the product and making your teeth or not sensitive using the correct or something, product. Yeah. Yes, if you overuse it, you will get sensitive teeth. If you go to the wrong people with the wrong product, because some people, there will always be shortcuts. Yeah. In everything vanity, yeah. there will true, be shortcuts. True, 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 so true. if you take the shortcut, there is that risk. So tell me, last but not least, but the, in terms of the advantages of doing this, apart from the nice shiny white sparkle you get in your teeth what 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 else are the other advantages of doing the other advantages is one 
side effect of the yeah. chemicals that are used in whitening yeah. actually stop the bacteria that can cause gingivitis and all of that oh. developing in your gums. Really? Yes. That's cool. Oh. So as part of the of that, they yeah. do clean out some of the bacteria that could be in there yeah. that could be just waiting for a situation to happen. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's that's awesome. <laughs> and now, so the whole the whole process and the whole it what's the cost involved in this? The cost involved depends on the kind of whitening you choose and depending on the need. The heavier the staining, yeah, obviously, yeah. the stronger the chemical. An estimate we from where to where? Use. So it's from ten thousand to yeah. sixteen thousand. Ten thousand. So the most expensive one is about sixteen k. Sixteen thousand. We do and have aftercare products. Yeah. Not sure if I have this yeah. 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 That's cool. That's but cool. But then that's to maintain it yeah. for at least four months. Okay. Yeah. Brilliant stuff. Hi, I'm Monique. I'm a fitness trainer. I'm a kickboxing trainer and a personal trainer. Mark Coffee, white coffee, three in one. It is easy and fast to make. In between clients, I can make a cup of Mark Coffee, white coffee, three in one. And it's only 15 shillings. Mark Coffee, power you are now. Tell me, like in, in Kenya, how many, uh, uh, are you the only one who's doing this? No, no. I'm not the only yeah, one yeah, doing yeah. this. There's uh, a few, mm -hmm. but I'd say that there are less than five. So what is the difference between you and a dentist cleaning my, whitening my teeth? It is the, first of all, mine is purely, purely, purely cosmetic. Okay. And it's non-invasive. Okay. We don't go into your mouth. There's no needles involved. There's no kind of, you know, consultation. It is all completely cosmetic at the, the levels of chemical that we use also yeah. are at percentages that are lower mm -hmm. than at the dentist okay and this is for like i said we have your dental situation has to yeah. be close yeah. to good and normal to perfect to avoid yeah. any other kind of yeah. situation happening so we do work very closely with dentists just, okay. some dentists use our products yeah. for people who just want yeah. Yeah. basic basic whitening yeah and then there's a special product which yeah. is now you know dental medical grade yeah. that is way above this yeah. that is used now inside the dentist office. awesome man i mean lisa i just i just uh, like what you're doing the fact that you've decided to empower yourself and just <laughs> say you know what you. i'm gonna go and do this and you, you it's, your startup is up and it's running yes i wish you all you. the best definitely you know, Thank if you guys you. want to widen your thing, you can contact her or just do your research and then you can ask her all her questions and all that stuff. And so now I want to give you a, a dose of your energy, a Mac coffee hamper for you. Thank you. You Thank can you enjoy very much. this while you're whitening people's teeth. I yeah. will. I will. <laughs> and thank you for coming <laughs> and we wish you all the best, Lisa. Thank, thank you so much.